hello and welcome <clears throat> so in this video we are going to install Nessus I, uh, I was surprised that it's not already pre-installed and I need it for uh, my certification and uh, if I can show you here it's on the right side basically it's what it's saying is that it's the compiling plugins are compiling so I have to wait for that so I was uh, thinking to install on my machine rather than on a try hack me so uh, first thing first let's search for it if you go directly to the website they're only selling uh, expert and professional uh, professional cost three thousand thirty five hundred dollar an year uh, expert call cost seven thousand that's a crazy amount of money and obviously uh, as a student nobody can even professionals I don't believe they can afford that per year so we're gonna go for essentials this is just a short form you can fill this one if you're business but I'm gonna go for education uh, get started give it our name all right so it's gonna send me the email I got already the email for the other one so I know it comes pretty quick so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I had it open okay right there so it must be this one all right so let me pause it here maybe I spoke too soon uh, it's not there yet but I do have my download link so I know uh, during the uh, process uh, of installing you can uh, register then as well so we're gonna try that if by the time I don't get the email with the code uh, we're here uh, don't go for Ubuntu there is a Debian that basically in the fine prints does say Kali so here it is Debian Kali I'm surprised it has for Amazon Linux too so it means that uh, AWS based uh, attack machines are becoming more common once again let's check it's Kali yes download it's pretty small file I believe 60 some MB total size is yes 63 MB you can see so to install it what we're gonna do is go still I don't have the email we're gonna launch our um, terminal let's go to LS. it's right there so what we're going to do is sudo d package i nope right there give it the password and it's installing so it's done here's the interesting part uh, these two these two lines now ignore this this is basically I believe this is the loopback address in IPv6 so basically it's either localhost uh, double call colon 8834 or 127.0.0.1 and the port number but before that we have to enable this one so what we're gonna say is um, it was system CDL let's start start no sudo slash bin slash system CDL start server. I don't have any error message so it means started uh, you can check it by system CDL status misused CDL status 
this is D, and you can see it says active right there so it means it's running now all left to do is go to our still no email but here what we can do is you can see already i tried oh no that's uh 1990 what's on 1990 must be cockpit or buzz probably cockpit all right so here we're gonna give it the port number 8834 bad request and it's basically it's actually telling you uh, telling you hey go to https so what we need to do is just in the beginning https and we have the page click advance and accept the risk and continue we can say register offline but we are already online we're gonna go for register for nasus essentials give it our name email please use a work email address i don't have that is why I, I i mean i do have but i don't want to give it the work email address so here it is i guess that i have to go back back start trial of nessus expert another tenable project i don't want professionals so what i'm gonna do is pause here go for that email again so that is my problem basically i have hit the uh, email hourly limit that's why i'm not receiving the code <clears throat> i already got uh, one so i have to wait for the whole hour uh let me see if i have another email address all right so i managed to grab uh, a code off of uh, another email address so let's go back to our registration Let's try it one more time. Essentials, continue, first name, skip big, and 5432 dash xkx4 dash. It's reminding me of good, uh, good old uh, Windows XP days. Is it gonna take it let's give it let's save it for now setup complete I need okay so now let's just gonna download the plugins it does take a uh, little bit I'm gonna pause the video here let it do its thing and the next step after that is gonna it's, it will be compiling those plugins so let's pause it so that was pretty fast um, I would say just a minute now it's gonna compile plugins I don't know it's gonna take the same time as it it it's taking in try hack me uh, or it's gonna be more uh, or less I hope less because uh probably my machine is a bit faster than their virtual machine but still I'm gonna pause it because I see this uh, icon is just going round and round all right so I took uh, about 13 minutes uh, and I have my everything is compiled uh, on the other hand if I look it's still compiling so definitely uh, yep it's it's still compiling so I believe that's one virtual CPU. I usually give mine virtual machine four virtual CPUs. So maybe that it is. So this is how you install. This is how long it will take. Uh, hopefully this video has helped you. If it has, please rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you in the next one.